वेलकम बैक नाउ न्यूज फ्रॉम स्पोर्ट्स Defending champions Musli Power Churchill Brothers defeated Chirag United by two goals to kneel in the I League Football Championship on Friday. With this victory, Churchill ensured that they will move into the new year perched at the top of the 14-team league. After this weekend, the I League team will have a month and a half a break owing to Indian team's training camps. Friday's match at Nehru Stadium at Faroda between Churchill Brothers and Chirag United from Kolkata assumed big importance since it was a top of the table clash. Churchill had got off to a slow start in the I League while Chirag had surprised everybody with their whirlwind beginning to the season. The Warka Warriors however proved with this win that they are back in form to end the first phase of India's top flight football competition at the top of the table. Churchill Brothers dominated the game right from the start and never allowed Chirag United to gain a foothold in the game. In the 5th minute, Ogba Kalu headed home to put Churchill ahead. Udafa Okoli put the issue beyond doubt with a goal in the 65th minute. This goal was a result of relentless attack from Carlos Roberto Pereira's boys despite being reduced to 10 men after Nascimento Silveira was sent off. Nigerian goal machine Udafa Okoli was named the man of the match. coaches of both teams spoke to prudent media after the match first up we have chances the coaching is the business that could not play well there is no such basis but our striking duo also we have mission was not there okay it happens something you know that we have uh, today not with the play that is in uh, not not easy for us and come more difficult as the the head card for us you know but they, we scored the second goal and uh, we win that's more important uh, uh, and now we have a long gap and uh, we are in the top because we do very well for that our reporter from margaon ramesh naik raut Goa defeated Assam in the quarter finals of the Kabaddi Championship at the ongoing 35th National Women's Sports Festival at Fatoda in Madga on Friday. Goa however failed to hold their nerve in volleyball and coco as they lost narrowly to Chhattisgarh and Maharashtra to cash out of the respective competitions. Goa dominated the Kabaddi quarter finals against their counterparts from Assam and went on to win by 17 points to 5. The Goa women were in control of the proceedings and did not allow their rivals to settle down. The hosts however could not go the distance in volleyball. Goa was second best to Chhattisgarh in a close contest in volleyball with the hosts going down fighting 21-25 and 18-25. A similar fate awaited Goa's Kokko team which narrowly lost their match against Maharashtra by 7 points to 5. Here are the best moments of the Kabaddi quarter finals between Goa and Assam. Our sports reporter Noel D'Souza with reporter Samir Bhatt from Margaon. 
Friday 13th is associated with a belief that the day proves to be lucky or unlucky to some people. Usually this day is considered Dracula Day or Horror Day. The famous movie series Friday the 13th derives its name from the same belief. 2009 had altogether three Friday 13ths. On 13 February 2009, the 13th part of the movie Friday the 13th was released. The first part was released in the year 1980. We leave you with these chilling visuals from the movie Friday the 13th. Till then, keep watching Prudent Media. Crystal Lake.